Hello everyone, welcome back to yet another Phenomen 12 video and today I have a 3x3 button panel for you. Now the circuit in the sticking out of the wall one and the flush with the wall one is exactly the same. So I'm only going to show you one and uh, like obviously this can be flush, made flush with the wall. It's just putting blocks there. So, I'm going to show you the sticking out of the wall one. Um, each button has a separate output in this build. So, this is a great way to make, oh, I don't know, a game of tic-tac-toe for, some, for something. And I just made the frame for the one flush with the wall without even realizing there we go without removing the grass please or the iron so sticking out of the wall and as you can see I have six torches laid out just like that then place repeaters along these lines three blocks on there blocks like that redstone 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 under there I'll just uh, have a block like that. Uh, then you go down with this repeater and a block there, a little lag, block, <laughs> repeater. And that should cover the um, bottom three lamps. One, middle, three. There we go. Um, now the next part, you have three repeaters like this. Again, three blocks like this. Torch there, torch there, and torch there. Lamp, lamp. So these will be your uh, outputs. And then just have a block with redstone at top. Very, very easy design. And uh, I can block this off. Uh, no you can't. <laughs> I was gonna say you can have uh, dust there but you can't because the repeaters will power that block and blah blah blah. So one, a two, and a three. There we go. Um, next layer. Torch or torch above the torches so that they are off. Block Let's just first lay out our lamps. Block, block. Ah, uh, well, that shouldn't be a block. That should be a half slab. For quite obvious reasons. Hint, hint, torch. Um, and another one. Now, obviously, you could have uh, repeaters. A repeater on there instead of the half slab down there. I guess um, but that's I just wanted to make it as resource efficient as possible and then you just place a block there going out from this torch and going into the lamp now that should be it um, yeah very very easy to make to make make to make very resource friendly obviously each input only gives off one signal so, that's it. I want to thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you all next time. Bye-bye.